Hello YouTube, this is Fastball11 here, coming at you with another video. This video is back on Fastcraft, where we start off at the brand new Guardian Farm, where we already have tons of double chests filled with um, prismarine shards, fish, ink sacks, and prismarine crystals. And as the world seemingly doesn't load in, I try and reload the chunks, but nothing works. So we're going to head on over all the way back. In fact, I think, no, I'm not, because that might be a little bit dangerous. I was going to head back through the water. It's not that far of a journey, but I guess I'll show you the nether tunnel, which is also complete, and it just so happens that it lines up perfectly with this portal over here, which is the Mushroom Island portal. So it says, two Guardian Farm, now open, free items. So I think that's pretty good. And I've also forgotten to bring food along, so I will be stopping back at the base where I have some more stuff to show you. Unfortunately, I can't show you everything that's happened, but along the way, I want to talk to you guys about something. It's something recent that has just happened. A new player has, well, a new person has come into play. The Rising Sun was here. Now, I have no idea who this is, but recently they've been leaving things behind. This just happens to be one of them, and this, and this, and several other banners. So far, we've been leaving them alone, but I don't know how long that's going to last. If we go up here, you can see that I've also constructed a rainbow beacon. I've done a lot off camera, but there's also this. See how there's one, two flags there? There's now a third, which is definitely really interesting. Anyways, we should probably head over this direction so that I can go back to the base and pick up some food. <laughs> and I have some stuff to show you over there too. But anyways, today is going to be more of a talky episode, so sit back, relax, and enjoy, because I don't have that much time to record, and you'll figure out why. <laughs> so yeah, again, sit back, relax, and enjoy the episode. We only have four seconds of junk boots left. Oh, and, and this, this banner right here. I also redid the area down here as well. Um, started work on this, but didn't get really far. I only got to, like, replace the stone brick there. But we, I did add a, a minecart elevator, which only goes down to level 40, I think. No, 41. My bad. But then you can quickly pop back up, head out into the storage room, which has also been redone. I've moved all the chests over by one because the room was uneven especially compared to this room which I will show you all in a second which I've also redone but I've added sea lanterns in because of the guardian farm instead of glowstone which I think looks a thousand times better but anyways let me search for the food items here aha there's some fish nope food very little I guess mushroom stew it is um, let me, let me sort all this. Drives me crazy when stuff is left behind, like in different rows and chests. Anyways, let me drink some of this and put it back. Alrighty, now that we're all supplied with a ton of mushroom stew I can show you this notice board over here or not notice task board so far we have some stuff over here and if you pause you can see that if not then oh well <laughs> but we have this nice little lava um, lava glass cover thing over here but anyways we also have some uh, quartz floor and quartz ceiling, which I think looks really nice. It used to be stone before, but I have changed that, and I've also added lava, 
to look into over here. And a gift for On The Rise 5, a super smelter, which I think he's really going to enjoy because before this, it was just furnaces. By the way, if On The Rise 5, you're watching this, then you can like extend these like cobwebs out and coal blocks out as far as you want, decorate the room. I just made it like this. And also we have room for expansion in between this and this room. This is something I'm going to wait on until in probably the next episode. Because it says a present from the rising sun with a banner. Now I have not even stepped on that pressure plate yet because I'm waiting for On The Rise 5. He knows about the rising sun and he knows what he's done and he knows about that. But he doesn't know what's inside and neither do I. But for, I think, all of this week, he's unavailable, so. Anyways, I did build this as well. This little slime block thing. And since everybody knows, it used to be a secret door before the entire base was moved over here. But it, it, it's not really that secret anymore. Everybody knows about it, and it's a button out in the open anyway, so. It doesn't really make that much of a difference. And it's easier for me to do. But anyways, besides that. I wanted to have a little bit of a talky episode while I just run around and do stuff, I guess. <laughs> but anyways, r recently, in fact, today, well, actually, no. Let me start from the beginning. For about four weeks now, the side of my leg and the front of it, or if you guys want to be more specific, the shins have been hurting quite a bit. It started off as a small pain though, and it progressively got worse. And now it's, well, gotten so bad that I've got to be in a boot, which absolutely sucks. <laughs> Because now I can't, I can't dance for two to four, two to six weeks rather. And I don't know what it is. I have no idea. Like, it could be on the shin, on the shin bone. It's just that general area. Or it could be something else. It could be tendonitis. It could be a stress fracture. I have no clue what is going on. And I've got tons of like bone scans and x-rays and doctor's appointments scheduled for quite a bit so I don't know how this schedule is gonna work out so if I am not true to my schedule I'm going to try my absolute best to stick to the schedule but if it doesn't work out I want to tell you guys while I'm sitting in this seat Screenshot. <laughs> Wait, no. Let me hold nothing in my hand. Eh, I'll just drop this on the floor. No! No! There we go. But anyways, I just wanted to say that I'm not sure if I can stick to my schedule 100%. I will still up upload videos. I just don't know if something will be like cut off one day or something but I apologize for that but it is completely out of my tr control and again it, if I had the choice I'd be able to I'd still be dancing and I'd still be bleh, and I'd still be able to make YouTube videos as much as I wanted but Unfortunately, life life throws you curveballs, and I have to deal with it, which sucks, but again, it's life. So anyways, I'm sorry if this is a little bit of a shorter video, but it, it's very important. So anyways, I hope you, you all enjoyed, and I will see you in the next video. This has been Fastball11 here, signing out. Goodbye, guys.